The Scandalous and Controversial Life of Sarah Churchill, Unveiling the Shadows Sarah Churchill, the daughter of Winston Churchill, lived a life filled with both public accomplishments and personal turmoil. While her father fought political battles, Sarah navigated through a series of personal challenges and scandals that often put her in the public eye for all the wrong reasons. Here are some of the most scandalous and controversial facts about her life. Fact number one. Marriage to Vic Oliver. Sarah Churchill's early defiance and determination to carve her own path were evident in her decision to marry Vic Oliver, an Austrian-born comedian who was nearly twice her age. This decision came after her involvement in the arts, where she showcased her talent by joining a dancing troupe, the Kit Kat Players, performing on Chartwell's lawn, which highlighted her zeal for performing arts despite her parents' reservations. The marriage to Oliver in 1936 was not just a matter of controversy due to the age difference but also because of Oliver's background and the societal expectations of the time. Oliver, a divorced entertainer, represented a stark contrast to the traditional values held by Sarah's family, particularly her father, Winston Churchill, who later expressed his disapproval by noting Oliver was common as dirt. Their union, which eventually ended in divorce, set the stage for Sarah's complex and often scrutinized personal life. Number 2. Struggles with Alcoholism Sarah Churchill's battle with alcoholism became one of the most public aspects of her personal struggles. Her addiction led to multiple incidents that attracted public and media attention, including arrests for causing scenes in public and even a brief period of remand in Holloway Prison. These episodes not only affected her career in the entertainment industry but also cast a long shadow over her public image, showcasing the intense pressure and scrutiny she faced living under the legacy of her father. Her struggle with alcoholism is a poignant reminder of the personal battles faced by individuals, regardless of their public persona or family background. Number 3. Controversial Romantic Life and Marriage to Anthony Beecham after her marriage to Vic Oliver ended, Sarah Churchill continued to navigate a complex and often scrutinized romantic life. Her marriage to Anthony Beecham in 1949 was marked by its own set of challenges. Beecham, a society photographer, represented a new chapter in Sarah's life, yet the marriage was troubled and ultimately ended in separation. The tragic suicide of Beecham in 1957 was a devastating blow to Sarah, leading her into a period of profound grief and exacerbated her struggles with alcoholism. This period of her life was characterized by public scrutiny and sensational headlines, further complicating her efforts to find stability and peace amidst personal turmoil. Number 4. Brief and Tragic Second Marriage to Baron Henry Audley Sarah Churchill's marriage to Thomas Percy Henry Tushy Jessen, the 23rd Baron Audley, represented a beacon of hope in her tumultuous life. Their union in February 1962 was a moment of joy amidst the challenges Sarah faced. However, the sudden death of Baron Audley from a heart attack in July 1963 exemplified the fragile happiness in Sarah's life. This period, albeit brief, was a testament to Sarah's search for stability and love, overshadowed by the recurring theme of loss that permeated her life. The impact of this loss on Sarah was profound, contributing to her later struggles and further highlighting the personal challenges faced by individuals in the public eye. Number 5. Role in Secret Intelligence During World War II Sarah Churchill's involvement with the Women's Auxiliary Air Force, WAAF, and her role at the Photographic Interpretation Unit at Mednam placed her at the center of critical wartime intelligence efforts. Her work in analyzing aerial reconnaissance photographs was not just a duty, it was a significant contribution to the Allied forces' strategic planning, especially notable during the preparation for Operation Torch in 1942. This role underscored Sarah's departure from the societal expectations of her as a prime minister's daughter, embracing a position of considerable responsibility and influence. Her dedication and contribution were emblematic of her complex character, combining her public persona with a deeply personal commitment to supporting her country in a time of global conflict. Number 6. Participation in Key Historical Events Sarah Churchill's presence at key World War II conferences, alongside her father Winston Churchill, offered her a unique insight into the workings of global leadership during one of history's most turbulent periods. 
Her participation at the Tehran and Yalta conferences was more than symbolic, it was an embodiment of her active role in the historical narrative of the 20th century. Witnessing the negotiations that shaped the post-war world order, Sarah's experience at these conferences highlighted her unique position at the crossroads of personal family relationships and pivotal global events. This intersection provided her with a unique perspective on the war and its aftermath, contributing to her complex legacy both within her family and in the broader historical context. Number 7. Artistic Pursuits Amidst Scandal Sarah Churchill's life was a canvas of varied experiences, with her artistic endeavors marking significant highlights. Despite the controversies and personal challenges she faced, Sarah's talent in the arts shone brightly. She was not only an accomplished actress but also a skilled artist. Her foray into lithographic prints, particularly a series of portraits of her father, Sir Winston Churchill, showcased her artistic prowess and garnered commercial success. These works were not merely portraits but represented a deeper, personal connection with her father, encapsulating the complexity of their relationship and her admiration for him. However, the recognition of her artistic achievements was often overshadowed by the public's focus on her personal life challenges. Number 8. A Life in the Public Eye being born into one of Britain's most historically significant families, Sarah Churchill's life was under constant scrutiny from the public and the media. Every decision, every misstep, and every achievement was amplified and dissected, making her personal struggles a subject of national discourse. This level of attention is a stark representation of the challenges faced by individuals in the public eye, especially those belonging to prominent families. The weight of her heritage and the expectations placed upon her shoulders were immense, showcasing the often unseen pressures that come with such a legacy. Number 9. Strained but loving relationship with Winston Churchill. Despite the tumultuous aspects of her life and the rebellious choices she made, Sarah maintained a deep and affectionate relationship with her father, Winston Churchill. Her role as his aide de during crucial World War II conferences like Tehran and Yalta underscored not only her loyalty but also her significance in Winston's life. Their extensive correspondence revealed a mutual affection and respect, highlighting a bond that transcended the typical father-daughter relationship. Winston's affectionate nickname for Sarah, Mule, was emblematic of her resilience and independence, traits he both admired and despaired at times. Number 10. Final Years and Untimely Death The final chapter of Sarah Churchill's life was a complex tapestry of creativity and personal challenges. Despite her declining health, Sarah remained committed to her artistic pursuits, including writing and painting, showcasing a passion for the arts that never waned. Her last years were marked by efforts to rejuvenate her stage career, underscoring her enduring love for the performing arts. Sadly, her journey came to an end in 1982 when she passed away due to an acute internal condition. During her last moments, a confidant played music she had composed, symbolizing the culmination of a life dedicated to creativity, resilience, and self-expression amidst turbulence. Her death signified the close of a significant chapter in Britain's cultural and historical landscape. Significantly, Sarah Churchill did not have children. This fact adds a poignant note to her legacy, emphasizing a life that, while devoid of direct descendants, was rich in contributions to the arts and her country. Her lack of heirs means that her artistic works, her service during World War II, and the memories of those who knew her personally or through her public persona, constitute the legacy she leaves behind. In this way, Sarah's impact and memory are preserved through her contributions to British culture and history, rather than through lineage, highlighting a unique path among the Churchill family narrative.